Hey Cucumbers, I previously showed a vintage triplet analog multimeter and explained why I think it's a great DIY bio tool. In this video, I want to show a cheaper and simpler alternative that you can easily build yourself. Since it has three voltage ranges of 30, 300, and 3000, and is inspired by the triplet multimeter, I call it the Triplo. While the triplet multimeter is a great piece of engineering, it's actually over-engineered for typical DIY bio purposes. The key function is the DC voltage measurement. This can be used as a readout for running gels or for measuring electroporation voltages. The current and resistance readouts are nice to have, but not strictly necessary, and add complexity. In addition, as a vintage device, there is a limited supply which can affect the price and availability of replacement parts if something breaks. For those reasons, I wanted to build a simplified analog voltmeter with modern, readily available parts. Initially, I considered trying to reverse engineer just the DC circuit from the original triplet schematics before I realized that all I needed was a voltage divider. In principle, if you wanted to get a 10 times reduction in the voltage readout, you would just need to add a resistor that is 9 times the internal resistance of the analog voltage dial. In my case, that resistance was 28.25 kilo ohms, so I needed 255 kilo ohms to increase the voltage range from 30 volts to 300 volts. Adding another 2.55 mega ohm resistor in series would allow a readout of up to 3000 volts. The 300 volt range is useful for running gels, while the 3000 volt range is useful for electroporation experiments. Since I couldn't easily source any 255 kilo ohm or 2.55 mega ohm resistors online, I simply put two 510 kilo ohm resistors in parallel to get 255 kilo ohms or two 5.1 mega ohm resistors in parallel for 2.55 mega ohms. The result isn't very pretty, but it works. As you can see, if we use the analog dial with the 30 volt range to measure a 9 volt battery directly, we read the 9 volt as expected. Once we switch the leads to add the 255 kilo ohm resistor, we now read 0 0.9 volts, showing that our voltage range is now actually 300 volts. If we switch the leads to add the 2.55 mega ohm resistor, we should read 0 0.09 volts, but that's too small to read on our dial. So that's the triple O voltmeter. Hopefully you found the information useful. And as always, remember to be careful when working with higher voltages in these ranges.